Okay, in this video I'm going to show you how to uh, add and subtract fractions with the same denominator. Okay, so we've got here the fraction 1 quarter. The top number is the numerator, bottom number is the denominator. And basically if we have uh, a fraction such as uh, 3 fifths, and we add 1 fifth, okay, the denominator is going to always be 5. Okay, These denominators stay the same. All you're really doing is working with 3 plus 1. Okay, 3 plus 1, okay, which gives you 4 fifths. If you can, you should uh, reduce or simplify this fraction, but in this case we can't. Okay, let's suppose we have um, uh, 2 sixth plus uh, three sixths okay that's going to be two plus three over six which gives us five sixths okay again we can't reduce this we can't simplify it because there's nothing that goes into five and six evenly without any leftovers so um, we have to keep this one and this one as they are. Okay, and that's basically how you um, add up uh, fractions of the same denominator. Okay, so let's move on to the subtraction. Okay, so uh, in this case we're looking at uh, 7 eighths and subtract 4 eighths. Okay, and what's that going to give us? Well, again, we have to keep the denominators the same. The denominators are, are always going to be the same. All right, and so it, again, it's just um, we're just working with the numerators, so it's just going to be seven subtract four. Um, that's going to be three eighths, okay. And we can't reduce that because there isn't anything that go that divides evenly into three and eight. Uh, so this is already in simplest terms. Okay, let's go to uh, eleven fifteenths subtract five fifteenths again. The, denom the denominator is going to be the same, and we're just going to be taking 11 and subtract 5. Okay, and that works out to 6 fifteenths. Okay, in this case we can reduce or simplify it. Okay, uh, because 3 goes into 6, so we can divide this numerator by 3, and we can divide the denominator by 3. It gives us 6 divided by 3 is 2. And 15 divided by 3 is 5. Okay, so now this fraction is in simplest form. Okay, so I hope that's been of some use to you. Um, you can uh, try the following uh, subtraction if you like, just to see if you can if you can do it on your own. Uh, if not, if you have a problem, then you should uh, restart the video and have a uh, watch it again. Okay, so uh, try. Uh, 17 twentieths subtract 9 twentieths equals something. Okay? So uh, you work that, pause the video, work that out, and in a second I'll give you the answer. Okay, well, as you should know by now, uh, the denominator is going to be 20. Okay, so basically we're just working with uh, 17, subtract 9. Okay, so that's going to be 8 twentieths. We can reduce that, okay, because uh, 4 will go into 8. Okay, so divide by 4, and we can divide this by 4 as well. Whatever you do to the uh, numerator, you have to do to the denominator. Okay, so uh, 8 divided by 4 is 2. And 20 divided by 4 is 5. Two-fifths again. Okay? Alright, I hope that's been helpful. Good luck.